the scary walk in the woods, we call it here in, in Ballina. We have about 60 to 70 people dressed up in the, in the forest. At night time, the, the folks, the people go through in groups of about 30 or 40, and we just hide behind the trees and jump out and scare them as much as we can. We're doing this as our ninth year, doing it, so it's been uh, very popular, very good. We get big crowds every year. We've been meeting up to, for the last six weeks, we've been meeting three, four nights a week, getting the props ready, doing a bit of painting here and there, and uh, a lot of work goes into it. But with a core 10 or 12 people, that helps us. So it's, it's really enjoyable. We want you. Hours. So they'll queue up, they'll come through, it'll be pitch black when they come through. There'll be five or six waiting for them behind trees, you jump out, you scare them, it's great fun. Then they'll come to the uh, horse's grave, and that's all lit up, and there'll still be, there'll be smoke, blue lights, flashing lights, and there'll be more scares then. And it just, we go right down by the uh, Bleak Castle entrance and across to the river. We kind of have um, a scary hospital effect, kind of lunatic asylum really, if you want to call it. Uh, the, the mums, the, 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 the nervous mums are very good. They have great fun with the nervous mums. And the cool dads think they're cool until somebody jumps out in front of them. It's amazing. It's one of the nicest forests, I think, in, in Ireland. Um, this forest is in the town boundary, so I think there's only two or three forests in, in Europe that, ha that, that has that. It's great to have. You can see all the kids walking around here today. If you come at 8 o'clock in the morning, there's people out jogging. If you come at 8 o'clock in the evening, they're out walking, jogging, cycling. It's a fabulous place.